Welcome back to Snipe City Cards Series 2 release date. Upper Deck 2021 Series 2. We got John Tavares on the front. So we got a hobby box here. Eight cards per pack. Looking for six young guns. Um, off a quick look at what has sold. Tim Stutzla and Kirill Kaprizov are definitely the two guys you're looking out for here. Um, they got fluorescence in here. Um, and then just some standard stuff that you normally find in Series 2 PG updates. Um, and then all that jazz. So hopefully we get something good out of here. We'll see what we got. So, Upper Deck, Series 2. Let's get into it. So we got 24 packs, 8 cards a pack. Let's get into it. First up, we got a marquee rookie of Victor Soderstrom. All right, we have a... Not sure why there's just a plain white card behind there, but... That's interesting. Only seven cards in here with a plain white card in there, so... Don't know what the deal is on that. Missing one card from there. All right, pack two. We got our first Young Guns. It is Ilya Sorokin. So not a bad start, Ilya Sorokin. A few have sold today in and around the $50, $60 mark. You get our Matthews Pedersen checklist as well. Third pack here, we have a portraits. We got a Lucas Carlson portraits rookie. All right, pack number four. It's another Young Guns, something with a G. It is Gage Quinney. So Gage Quinney Young Guns. Alright, next pack here we have Brandon Gallagher, UD Canvas. It's starting to rain out here. I don't know if you guys can hear that, but next pack is Marquee Rookies, Alexander Alexiev. Alright, next one here is Oh, we got a clear Anthony Sorelli. Clear cut base. He did a good job on the uh, on the back side here. A lot nicer than some of the other stuff for sure. Alright, on to the second stack. We've got a Nico Mikola, marquee rookie. We've got a Portraits in here, Artem Zagadulin, and in behind it, we've got a Young Guns Checklist, Tim Stutzla and Dylan Cousins. So there's your checklist here. Kaprizov starts it off, Sorokin's another big name, Nils Hoglander. Okay, Andre Miller, Cal Foot, Tim Stutzla. What else we got here? Dylan Cousins. That's the big names that I recognize from there. All right, next here we've got Marquee Rookie, Ole Ulevi. Packaging feels a lot nicer, that's for sure. Um, we've got Logan Couture, UD Canvas. That retro. That's a cool looking picture with the cool looking jersey. Logan Couture Canvas. Next up, another Young Guns here. We've got Jordan. Is that Gross? Gross? I'm not entirely sure who this is. 
Well, there we go. All right, next up, we're on to the third stack. We have award winners, Victor Hedman, OPG. All right, we got another Young Guns here, and it is Yanni Hakanpa. Hakanpa, Hakanpa. I am not overly familiar with this player. We've got another UD Portraits. We've got Portrait Rookie of Ty Delandria. Delandria. Next up, we got another Young Guns here. Looking for Kaprizov or Stutzla, someone big. We've got Maxim Latunov. All right. We got Tara Vine and UD Canvas. Next up here, we've got Bowen Byram, marquee rookies. Oh, next up we got a UD exclusive, 74 of 100, Justin Hall for the Maple Leafs. Not half bad as a Maple Leafs fan. 74 of 100. All right, moving on, we've got Matt Dumba, award winners. Four packs to go. We've got Brandon Hagel, Portrait Rookie. Next, we have another marquee rookie. We, you know, we got an award winner, Nathan McKinnon, OPG award winner. Next, we have something shiny. We got a Dazzlers here, and it looks like a Young Guns canvas based on the color there. So our Dazzlers is Zach Parise. And we got a John Leonard, Young Guns Canvas. Last pack here. We got one more Young Guns here, one more chance. We got Maple Leafs Alexander Barabanov. We got a Barabanov, Latunov, Hakanpa, Gross, Gross. We got the Stutzla Cousins. Oh, this is a French variant. There is my French card. Okay, so that's interesting. Stutzla Cousins French variant checklist. Missed that on the first go through. We got Gage Quinney and Ilya Sorokin. So did fairly good with six young guns. We got a Justin Hall UD exclusives. We got Anthony Sorelli clear. And we got John Leonard. Young guns canvas. Well, the French one's a little bit more than I originally thought. We're looking at probably in and around 15 to 20 bucks, but that's it. Sorokin kind of saving the break here. Um, I don't know. Hard to get a breakdown. Uh, we've been trying to do some breakdowns on some of these cards um, at the end of the video, but it's very difficult with the new stuff coming out. Values are all over the board. But um, if the Sorokin goes for 60 bucks, um, there was a Gage Quinney that was $50 offer accepted. I'm not sure. The rest of these guys, I'm not too sure about. Um, I don't know. Maybe with all the young guns, we ran at about a hundred bucks. I would say a bit of a loss on this one, but all things considered, the hobby box was $150, so it wasn't half bad. Anyways, thanks for watching.